In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to make graphical buttons similar to the one that you see here, this home button. Let's get started. We're going to start with a plain gray canvas. We're going to use our rectangle select tool. We're going to round the corners by a radius of 50 and draw our graphical button. We're going to add a new layer and we're going to call this layer base. And in the base layer, we're going to drop a bright blue color. There we go. We're going to add another layer. We're going to call this gray 1. The blue is going to serve as a, an outline for us. Um, so we're going to shrink this selection by 3 pixels. And in the gray 1 layer, we're going to add a light shade of gray with our fill bucket. We're going to add another layer. We're going to call this layer gray, th gray number 2. And we're going to shrink our selection one more time, this time by 6 pixels. And we're going to add an even lighter shade of gray. gray 2. Select none. Now we want to make it look like these two are blending together. This is um, a stylistic thing. If you don't want to do this, you don't have to. Um, and we're going to blend those by doing a Gaussian blur of 6 or 7 on the gray 2 layer. So now we have this blend. Um, our last thing that we need to do is add the light effect so we're going to call this light effect. And to add the light effect, we're going to use the path tool. I'm going to zoom in for the path tool and make it just a little bit easier. We're going to get ourselves some paths, path nodes here. Hold down the control key. Um, we can drag these paths. can drag our handles to adjust the curvature of the path, just like so. And that's going to get us pretty much close enough to what we want. Now we're going to make a selection from the path. We have a nice selection. We'll pick a different tool. There's our selection for our light effect. Uh, we'll take white now and drop the white into our light effect layer. There we go. Um, turn our selection off. And our last step would be to add our words. And we'll just write in home. Darken that up just by a little bit. Get the correct one, that helps. There we go. So we have home, we'll close. Move this guy up so that it's in both regions. Zoom back out. And there you have a simple but fairly effective graphical button.